Hi friends. So today we will tell you something about the acne vulgaris and its extraction. The word acne vulgaris is derived from a Greek word, where the acne comes from ekun, which means a point, and vulgaris. The word vulgaris means common. So this is a word. means something pointed and which is very common on the skin is known as acne vulgaris there is a another word which is known as acne inversa means point is upside down acne are most common during the teen years but they may be seen early or late stages many teenagers they damage their face by excusing the acne using the fingernails or trying different and different techniques as a result they develop scars let me tell you something about these scars these scars can be of three types like eye pick scars eyes pix scar box scar scar box scar scar and the rolling scar sometime these scars when they get hyperpigmented are known as hyperpigmented scars we'll try to show you these scars in the coming videos so here we are educating about the extraction of white heads from whole of the face mostly on the forehead cheeks nose is already clear acne are common as i have already said in teenagers due to the inflammation and blockages of pilo sebaceous unit and because of that they suffer a lot in this case the acne vulgaris are present on the chest and back and when the whole of the body or there they get involved so such people they suffer from anxiety they have reduced a low self esteem what happens during the teen years these are during this age the hormonal changes occur in the body and some hormones like testosterone level increases in the body some people's skin is able to tolerate this condition and in some of the people the skin develop this lesions which are known as acne vulgaris the skin is not able to accept this change so as a result this is happening normally a bacteria a lot of bacteria are present on the skin one of them is propionobacterium acne when this bacteria proliferates the acne development happens gene is one of the risk factor and first degree relative that the chances of high, are high of developing this acne one thing that we can reduce is that if we reduce the low sugar in diet they help in reducing the acne so when comes the pregnancy you have to be more careful you can give only the topical topical applicants but you should never and never give retinoids never give spironolactone or 
finite steroid never give this one more trick which i want to tell you is that uh, in cases of inflamed acne when the acne are getting inflamed high injection of corticosteroid in that particular reason give a sudden relief so this is how we will do the extraction these all are white heads or the closed comedons on 2nd of july i visited a meditation center of pavan sinaji whose channel i have already subscribed and it was a great experience there i will share the few techniques for those who are doing meditation in my earlier videos i have also already told that what i have done from nearly about 7 month yeah i started meditation from about 1st december 2016 and i am very regular to it with the god grace daily i used to wake up early at about 4 am early in the morning sometime at 4 4 sometime up to 4 15 i am able to wake up and then i take the bath do the brushing etc etc and at 4 55 am sometime early or sometime late up to 5 or 5 10 i used to sit for the meditation the sunrise usually happening at about uh, 5:30 am here and for about 1 hour i have been regularly meditating so a you should also be you should be regular this is what i want to say thank you for giving your valuable time see you in the next videos